20 to 7 and the sun is still shining. Can't fault that, can you? Right, so last night went and got some pallets. Um, two there, I've got four in total. Um, yeah, two back there, sorry. <clears throat> and one there and one the other side. But I finished this off. All been painted apart from that little one there. That's all been done. If I show you. I don't think it's nice and sturdy. It's quite deep in the ground. And then I've got this up just to join the two pallets. They're weeds that I've just picked up. Um, I've done this. So that's all covered. For some reason it looked really small without the fabric down. Now the fabric's down. It's... Uh, it's uh, like, wow, I may need a forest <laughs> to cover this, but at least it's covered. Um, that's the main thing. Also, we have this. Now, made this today. Um, I'll put a link if I can below, um, because I got a 10 pack of wood. They're not treated, so you're gonna have to treat them. Um, not like treat them as in treat them with care. You know what I mean. Um, so these are this was a this is a 10 pack and they are 2.4 meters long they're not you know they're good for what I need but you know they're not very big but they are long which is what I wanted um, so they were nine pounds something from Wix's they um, they had a couple of pounds off I think they would have been just under 13 and I've got them for just under 10 so you know every bit of saving so that was 10 in there and I think home base wanted what did they want? I think it was 2 99 or 3 99 for a two meter length and that was just for one so um, yeah go to Wix's if you have one near you go to Wix's so much cheaper so I made this today now this it's not finished yet um, because I, I need another pair of hands to help me um, screw the legs onto this base so what I did was is that I um, well one one plank I sawed kind of in half and it made one piece two pieces so out of one plank I've got two pieces and all that it is if I show you I was going to record stages, but yeah, it was really not. If you have a spare pair of hands, then it does help. Um, there's the legs, and it just is on this base. And then there's another, it's like it just, it's like a mirrored image at the top with these legs to hold it together. And then scaffolding that, that I had over in the bin. Um, and that's just. It was like these um, horseshoe, there we go, like the horseshoe nails. Um, anyway, so out of 10, I think we used what, one, two, three, four, five pieces all together. Five pieces. So out of that 10 pack, I can make two of these. Um, the scaffolding netting don't you learn these things as you go along but try to get the end bit down first because now I've got to join a piece all the way around whereas if I just done it like from down there I'd have only had to made a join across so that's my tip and also the onions are in now this is quite high for onions this uh, cage um, but it's universal so it can be for anything if you're going to make the cage another tip is make it taller than what you need so if you're going to make one for strawberries I would ideally make it a bit taller so then you have the option to use it for something else there's our tulips I think that one there is a little bit slower but that's them um, got a little one there, got another one coming up there, 
yeah a few little ones but anyway thank you for watching and i will see you guys soon bye